hello friends today in this tutorial i'll be showing you the package which allows you to draw images uh, draw colorful text inside the images text uh, you can see basically the demo of this application we have an image here from the internet pixabay.com and here we can draw colors on top of the image you can select your favorite color violet red you will see that you can also select the shade of color if you want to draw light or dark and there is also a save button as well so if I click the save button you will see the image will be saved here with the modifications you can see that basically you can choose your favorite color as well as the size of the color as well we have also the redo and undo options as well guys if you want to redo undo as well there is also a dustbin icon as well guys if you want to click this icon the image the image will be reset to its original form and uh, you can just select the size of the shade here if you if you want the bigger shade you, you can select this shade and now you can see that it will be very lighter so these colors are available to you so now let me show you the package for we are using the guys we are using this package which is ngx image drawing it's a very new package but still it is growing as the popularity 691 weekly downloads so i have written a complete blog post on this my website the link is given in the description of the video where i explained step by step instruction on how to integrate this and how to, to save this image on the, inside your computer we are using also this file saver dependency which allows you to save the image onto your computer file saver which we are integrating with angular 14 so the very first thing you need to do inside your angular 14 application guys you just need to install these two modules which is npmi ngx dash image dash drawing and then file dash saver so simply install these uh, two modules i have already done that so now let me start the angular application so the very first thing we need to do guys let me delete all that stuff uh, let me delete this also let me just start from scratch so the very first thing you need to do guys inside this directory structure you need to go to your app.module.ts file and here you just need to uh, basically paste our code here which is uh, for the import that module which we have installed which is uh, image drawing module so we will import that module import and we will use this dependency which we have installed image drawing and from this we will be importing the package which is image drawing module and after that you just need to add this inside your import array image drawing module and after that guys we just need to go to your app.component or html file and here we will have this directive which is image drawing so inside this directive guys it basically takes a lot of options first it takes is the image url you can even provide here also this image but we will be providing dynamically so we will be using a variable here which is image url and after that it takes basically the output meme type so whenever you download your image after you make the modifications we need to give it a file name which is uh, of the type image jpg you can even provide here png as well and then we have the output quality you can set control that quality from one zero to one let me set it to 0 0.9 and then basically we have the callback function whenever you click the save button this function will execute where you can pass your image to download this inside your computer so this is basically the directive which supports four options and now we just need to initialize these options inside your typescript file so just go to app.component.ts file and here you just need to first of all import that line at the very top for file saver which allows you to basically download the file after you make the modification you can see from file saver so inside this basically we have first of all the image url so this url you can take from any internet make sure that you don't uh, copyright issue so let me take this image copy image address paste it this is jpg image and then we will initialize the save function which will execute whenever you make this modification and here we will use the file saver module and it has this method save as 
which allows you to save this image inside your computer and here you pass the blob object of image and then the file name let me pass output.jpg that's all so now if you refresh your application guys this image will be loaded here you will see in the browser and we have got the colors out there you can see perform any modification here you can write something you can write text you can modify these images anything you can do with favorite color click on save here you can see your file is saved so you can see that so basically guys uh, this is the process by which you can modify the images you can write anything on them by using some color colorful text or thank you very much guys for watching this all the source code is given in the description of the video of this application